Hi friends, this is Dr. Anushree Duseja. I'm a posture therapist and I work to fix your bones and to fix your posture. Here is a quick routine today which we are going to do to correct every part of your body and bring your body in right alignment. All you need to give is just 15 minutes of your day. Do it any time. Do you have time in the morning? Do it in the morning, evening, night. I don't care. I want this 15 minutes routine done for you. Then you are going to help yourself fix that posture. So let's begin without any further delay. The first one is going to be the toe raises. We're doing it 20 times. We go up on your toes and come back down. When we go up on the toes, all the pressure is felt on the back side of the calf muscles and you can just enjoy the rhythm. Play some music for yourself or keep counting. Make sure you don't cross the count of 20. We are doing this 20 times. While you're doing this, you're feeling all the pressure coming on the calf muscles. You feel the burn on the calf muscles. It shouldn't give you pain, of course. If it does, reduce the count to 10 and then slowly build it up so you can reach the count of 20. Alright, I hope we all have finished the count of 20. And the next one, we go to the knee joint. All you need to do is push back the hip, go down and come back. One, two, three. Make sure all the load is coming from your thigh muscles. You're not getting any pressure on your knees. All the load is taken by your thighs and your glutes. I want you to go down, feel the pressure on the thighs, let the blood circulate through the body. I hope you're enjoying the burn already. We don't get enough time to move in the day, but 15 minutes is all I need for you. All right, five, four, three, two, and one. The next one, we've gone from the knee to the hip now. All we want is some side kicks. I want you to balance the whole body on one leg without leaning to the sides while you're doing it. I want you to just kick your hip. So this is dissociating your body. I want you to disconnect the body. I want you to use only the hip and kick. We're just doing 20, come on. The other leg, other leg, we have two sides. The other side, come on. One, two, three, four. Two pumps, I'm counting one, but the burn is all what matters. We're doing 20 reps, come on. Try not leaning to the sides, balance on one leg and kick. All right, no problem. You can take breaks in between but finish the count of 20. Wonderful. The next one, now from the hip, that is the turn of your back. All you need to do is place your leg a little at a distance and touch your toes down and come back and bend. Touch your toes down, come back and bend. Touching down, come back and bend. So when you touch down, the stretch is felt on your hamstring muscles and bend back supporting your lower back just do 10 of these only 10 reps bend backwards down and back it's a stretch so if you do it less number of times also it's okay for me now your back is ready to take the load so why don't we go down on your legs keep your toes pointed forward and roll your spine down lower back Middle back and upper back. Coming back, upper, middle and lower. We are doing this roll ups 20 times. Come on. The pressure is coming on the abdomen. 
feeling a stretch and a roll on the spine. I hope we are counting. Come on. You are doing 20 of these. It's difficult when you begin to exercise, but all it matters is to move a little. One, super, that was your core and your abdomen. The next we are going is to the upper back. For which I want you to come on your all fours. All you need to do is to take your shoulders down to the floor and come back. So arms on the side, go down and back. Two, make sure you're gathering the shoulder blades it's very good for the hunchback getting developed. It's very nice for the computer users. Make sure we are bending enough so that the load is on the upper back. Come on, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Now we are done with the shoulder. The next comes your neck. The neck which we strain throughout the day needs to move a little too. All you need to do is pull this chin backwards and relax. Pull it back, relax. We are just doing 10 of these. Pull your chin back, five, four, three, two, and one. We are ending our routine with a plank for one minute. I hope we all can do this. If not, take breaks. Do five, 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 five seconds and finish your one minute, guys. Come on. So for a plank, you need to come on your elbows such that your elbow is right under your shoulder hand shoulder width apart go on your toes and lift your body up while you're there all the pressure is on the core on your abdomen I don't want you to pike your hip up like that I don't want you to drop your back down like that maintain the neutral come on we are holding that for one minute we have the timer on before it hits the beep. Try staying up as much as you can, guys. Yeah, you can feel the vibration coming on the abdomen. Feel the burn. Ooh. That's it. All you need is 10 to 15 minutes routine for yourself and you're gonna have a fit posture. So that should be your routine for everyday fitness. This is how we fix you.